Hi, I'm Lisa Armstrong, celebrity makeup artist, and here for you today I'm going to show you how to perfect the beautiful ballroom day look. All the colours I'm using today have been personally selected by me to help you create your perfect Strictly look. Don't worry, you don't have to be a professional to create these looks. We're using easy step-by-step -step instructions. Anyone can achieve these looks. The beautiful ballroom look is inspired by the elegance and beauty of the ballroom dance. It's sophisticated, it's flawless, it's shimmery, glossy and ultra glamorous. So to become the belle of the ballroom, you start off by doing your eye makeup. The reason why you do this is because we're using three different shadows on this look and they tend to fall down on the skin. And if you are the belle of the ballroom, obviously you want beautiful skin. So we can't have any flaws, so that's why we start with the eye makeup. We use the two shimmery colours, a soft base colour on the lid of the eye all the way up to the brow bone and then we use a darker colour going along the lid, no higher than the socket line. This creates the tone of the look that we're going for. The darker shade then creates the tensity, which is in the socket line and around the lash line, blending all the time. We don't want to see where one colour starts and the other colour finishes. We want the whole thing blended. So we're going to use a chunky pencil to intensify the look. We use this around the lash line and underneath the outer core of the eye, making sure it's perfectly blended. I don't want to see the lines where the start to where it finishes. I want it soft and smoky. So next we're going to apply the mascara. Before you do this, make sure you curl your eyelashes. This will just give the look a lift. You don't want your eyes lashes shooting outwards, you want them nice and curling upwards. Before you apply your mascara, make sure that you wipe the mascara from the brush because you don't want too much ending up on your eyes. You can always add, and what we say is less is more. Brush in container, wipe off and then apply. When applying your mascara, make sure you go from the base of the lash right up to the tip. So you do this by a zigzag motion, going up the eye, up the eye, up the eye. Next, we're going to use a highlighter around the eye area. This will basically blend in your eyeshadows and just lift the brow bone. Underneath the eye, we use a highlighted concealer. This will just lighten up the face and take away the dark circles. For this beautiful ballroom look, we don't want to use anything too heavy on our skin. We want our skin to shine through, so we want to have something that's light reflective and highlighting. So blend that into the face from the inside of the face, blending outwards. For this look, we use a soft rose petal pink on the lips. Nice and glossy, keep it soft, keep it dewy, keep it fresh. Apply to the inside of the mouth and then blend to the outer corner of the lips. Don't go over your lip line and make sure you don't get it on your teeth. To complete this beautiful ballroom day look, use a bit of powder on the T-zone. This will just take the shine away and leave you looking beautiful and fresh. So now we've achieved the beautiful ballroom day look, I'm now going to show you how you can change it with three products into an evening look. So from our ballroom day look, we changed our, into our evening look with just three products. So we started by using the black gel liner into the inner eye, which really sort of vamped it up. Then we added gold glitter eyeliner pen, and we just literally lightly stroked it all across the eyelid, which really gave it that pingy effect. And then added a dark lip gloss, simple as that. I'm Lisa Armstrong and thank you for watching.